Election day is May 24th when Texans decide who will win the primary runoffs and represent each party in November. It's the political equivalent to Game 7. I'm Jack Fink, political reporter at CBS 11 and CBS News Dallas Fort Worth, and here are five key races we are watching. One of the most contentious races is the Republican runoff for Attorney General, where the two-term incumbent, Ken Paxton, is being challenged by George P. Bush, the Texas Land Commissioner. Paxton has played up his endorsement by former President Donald Trump and called Bush too liberal. Bush has told Republican voters to back away from Paxton because of his legal troubles, the fact that he's facing state felony charges and going to trial, and that his former top lieutenants at the attorney general's office made bribery allegations against him and reportedly went to the FBI. Paxton has denied any wrongdoing. He leads Bush in the polls. Another race, the Democratic runoff for attorney general between Rochelle Garza, a former staff attorney at the ACLU, and Joe Jaworski, former mayor of Galveston, who's now in private law practice. Garza has maintained a lead in the polls. For lieutenant governor, Democratic candidates Mike Collier and Michelle Beckley are in the runoff. Collier ran against Dan Patrick in 2018, and Beckley is a state representative in Carrollton. Polls are inconsistent, with one last month showing Collier in the lead and one this month showing Beckley leading. Many people say they still don't know who they will vote for. And then there's the Democratic runoff for the 30th Congressional District between Jasmine Crockett, a state representative from Dallas, and Jane Hope Hamilton, who's been a staffer in Congress and active in Democratic Party politics locally. There are no polls in this race, but Crockett nearly won outright in March 1st. Crockett has been endorsed by a long-term congresswoman, Eddie Bernice Johnson, who is retiring from this seat. Hamilton has been endorsed by State Senator Royce West, Congressman Mark Vesey, and longtime Dallas County Commissioner John Wally Price. And finally, the Republican runoff for Tarrant County District Attorney between former Judge Phil Sorrells and State Representative Matt Krauss. Sorrells has won the backing of former President Trump and former Governor Rick Perry, while Krauss has won the backing of Senator Ted Cruz and Tarrant County Sheriff Bill Wayborn. On May 24th, watch the results come in live on our streaming service, CBS News Dallas-Fort Worth, starting at 7 p.m. And watch CBS 11 News at 10 for the latest results.